<laughs> hey guys, I'm Anarchy, bring you the chaos. I'm not just says gaming. You know, and I'm Goblin and Green. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> and we are doing oh. a Guardians of the Galaxy <laughs> Volume Jesus. 2 review. Volume 2. Show uh, the fuck so out. We're going to be talking yes. about Guardians of the Galaxy 2. We just saw it. Yes. Uh, very good movie, it's I think. Good. Yeah, it's pretty, it's pretty good. One of the good Marvel movies ever. Yeah. You know, it's very rare to find. <laughs> it's a hidden gem in, amongst, yeah. like, sand. Sand. <laughs> amongst it's sand. It's like, it's like when, like, your dog eats, like, a diamond. And it poops, and there's a diamond in it. <laughs> Alrighty, <laughs> then. So Marvel <laughs> universe. Oh, God. Okay, All so. Right. Anyways, moving on. Thank on you for that, that note. You're welcome, everyone. That's great. Uh, All right. So, uh, let's Jesus. talk about the story. Because yes. mm. instead of the diamond-covered poop. Okay, I'll you go. I'll go. You start off with hentai. All right, so listen. <laughs> listen. So, they're on this fucking gold planet. And then there's, they're defending, they're defending it from a fucking, uh, they're weird alien. the batteries from a weird alien. <laughs> yeah. It, okay, and then Rocket steals the batteries, and ghoul people get pissed. True. Yes, that's And then they chase them weird. down, and then a man in an egg comes by, <laughs> yeah. kill, kills them all, um, <laughs> kills, them. kills them all, and then meets them on the planet they crash on. Yeah. Uh, and, and he's like, then hey. they, and then, like, Rocket Raccoon and, uh, the... <laughs> Uh, and whatever the fuck blue chick blue, yeah. blue, blue chick blue chick fuck. they stay on the planet well uh well fucking star lord Drax and Gamora go with egg guy to, yes because their father and son has their father yeah it's not, uh, that's not important <laughs> <laughs> yeah not at all that's not important that's not like not like the main right. point of the plot or anything, so you know? so ba so basically uh <laughs> basically point. they take the egg yes. and they go to the planet the, yes. the dad's on and dad reveals he's a celestial which is like a god, like a almost a god, pretty, pretty much. much. Yeah. Um, and it's basically like a brain in a planet. Yeah. Like <laughs> brain in a planet. Yeah, it was a literal brain. But, it, but he is the <laughs> And he is the planet. Yeah, yeah, he is the planet. And, and the human is construct, and he basically fucked uh, Peter Quinn's mom and shit like that. Yeah. yeah. Um, so basically... Uh, <laughs> 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 so so basically Rocket Raccoon and, and the blue bitch and Groot get yes, captured the by the bitch. space pirates. Baby Groot. I by say. the space pirates. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they go on the ship and then they kill everyone and then they go meet them on the planet that's a dude. <laughs> <There's> <laughs> what? They kill they kill the whole Yondu kills the whole crew. There we they go. They get on the ship and they go to the planet that's a guy. A brain in a planet. Oh, okay. I yeah, see. And then they defeat it has And then they and then you find out that Peter Quinn's uh, dad's a cunt. Yeah, we'll get it, to, but that's basically the point. Right. Let, is, 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 Let me finish! <laughs> right, so what they do, this like pretty powerful demigod, is they plant some C4 on it and blow it up. Yeah. And then Yandu dies, and there's some celebration, and then... Celebration? Yeah. What celebration? <laughs> there was you mean a funeral? There's fireworks to celebrate. Yeah, like a funeral fireworks. Not celebration. What? what are they celebrate? <laughs> Yay! Yandu's dead! It's weird, though, because an idiot. Fireworks. fireworks. Bro. It was like to honor him, I guess. But uh, anyways... And it was a then, celebration. And then, yeah, they become the second. I thought celebration was supposed to be happy. Well, it's, they're celebrating his life. Anyways. <laughs> um... <laughs> And yeah, that's pretty much it. I mean, yes. there's this really fucking buttery, cute ass like ten minutes at the end. Oh yeah. Just. And then they show off Adam Warlock, which is the thing that they'll do in Guardians Three, and that's the end of the movie. All right. So All right. characters. So characters. Uh, let's start with Star Lord. Yes. I guess he's like the main. Pretty character. much. Yeah. He was awesome. He was pretty cool. He he listened to music still. The same. Yeah. He had a little bit more leadership. Uh, like yeah, 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 in true. this one, I think, which was really good because he yeah. kind of is. Except him measuring dicks with a raccoon. Yeah, sure, that yeah, was yeah. the only part where it was like, okay, <laughs> yeah, <I got> <laughs> measuring dicks with a raccoon. Cool <laughs> That's an apt description. <laughs> yes, what happened. Yeah. So it was, it was cool. He had the whole dynamic. Him like and his dad, dad and stuff, and the so power like, and the light. I uh, like horses. Light. Yes. Light. See, guess he's not the only one that does light. They ask you how you are, and you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. Um, Shut the fuck up. <laughs> uh, who else? So, um, basically, uh, what I liked about Peter Quinn, uh, uh, Peter Quill, Quill. 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 <laughs> whatever, <laughs> yeah. uh, was, uh, there was a lot of, there's a lot more emotional range from him in this movie than there was in the yeah. first one. Especially, yeah. like, he, you gotta see him pissed yeah. and, like, crying yeah. and shit. Yeah. It was, True. I like, he had a little bit more range in there. As soon as he said, I had to put the tumor in your mom. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That in your mom! Oh, God. We actually wow. had to see, like, the actor actually yeah. have to play yeah. him part besides the funny yeah. dude. All right. Yeah, exactly. So, Rocky Raccoon did fuck all. <laughs> yeah, he did really? nothing, but he was the coolest person. I, I like so how they insane. connected him and Yondu. Yeah, that was cool. Yeah, that was kind of a cool little connection. Yeah, 
But that was really quick, though. It should have been, yeah. a, a, like, well, I mean, well... It was okay. I think it was okay, okay. Yeah, for what they could fine. do. But, um, I mean, like, they kind of took his baddest moments away. True, like, yeah, He got, like, one of the fours, yeah. but he gets fucked. So, like, yeah. yeah. So that was, like... Me. But, yeah, I mean, uh, yeah, Rocket Raccoon's a uh, raccoon that kills things. But Pretty then again, it. he killed the least amount of things exactly. in this movie. Yeah. I was just, I just... Well, no, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, true. But, uh, yeah, I mean, he sort of tries to have a story arc, but mm-hmm. doesn't really doesn't carry... Really. Yeah. It's okay, it's decent. Yeah, right. I mean, like, yeah, they talk sure. about the, the the scientists that created him a little bit more, uh, this yeah. one, but it's like, well, but still it hasn't been light. fleshed out. Yeah, yeah, it hasn't been fleshed out. Um, exactly. All right, so Dude. let's go with Drax. Uh, yeah, it's fucking, fucking nothing. Nothing. Absolutely, absolutely, absolutely useless, useless character. Useless. Zero happens. Literally he's there for the puns and Seriously, being savage, yeah. and that's it. Dumb, Even in more, a fight, yeah. he's like stupid. Still There's useless. not much to say yeah. about him, really. It goes with like my Avengers, I mean, like when we talk about why we don't like the Avengers team. Drax from the comics is good, but in the movie, he's kind of yeah. useless. He's, like, I don't know why. Like, he really does do much. Drax fans. And when he does do something, it doesn't work. Like when he's cutting yeah, the it's, it's, it's not, not even badass. Yeah. It's just like, fucking. Yeah. Um, <laughs> just to make him look like uh, more of an idiot. Let's go on to. Baby Groot? No, more. You, you want to talk about Baby Groot? No, because nothing happened. I guess we're going to go over that. Okay, Baby Groot was there just to be like, look at the cuteness. Also to sell uh, plushies. Also to sell plushies. <laughs> sell plushies. And stuff like that. That's why he yeah. there. I mean, he was funny. He was, he was funny. He had some comedy, really. So. But we already had that from, like, Drax and sure, yeah. Raccoon and Star-Lord and... All right, oh, yeah, Glamora. Glamora, uh, she didn't change much either. Yeah, she was no. kind she's of. She's a, a little bit less yeah. savage, but she's still. still she's t- still, uh, well, like, she she yeah. didn't like try and stab him with oh, yeah, they, like, sure, hugged yeah. and shit this time. But it's cool that you got to see her sister pulled that. Her out. nebula. Yeah. Oh yeah, okay, let's get a nebula. Yeah. yeah, I loved when they explained why she's a fucking yeah, robot. Yeah, sure, that, that was, was awesome. Sick. Because we were like, what the fuck? Yeah. I like, I like, I kind of, I, I like the resentment between mm-hmm. her and Glamora. Definitely, it was really well done. I really yeah. liked her kind of character arc. She's probably going to be an anti-hero, 100%. Yeah, yeah true, yeah. Um, and, I mean, I, I, all in all, yeah. I, I, pretty, I liked her. Honestly, like, I didn't, like, in the first movie, you freaking look at her and you don't give a shit. In this one, you're actually like, oh, yeah. fuck, she's really interesting. I mean, that's pretty so, much, like, I like their conflict and stuff. And good. She wants to get Thanos, but she's going a different way about it. All right. Yeah. And then so, Yondu. So fucking Yondu. Yeah. Yondu, Yondu is baller. He yeah, gets, he's just like, seriously. Don't like, fuck like, with Yondu. I love the flashbacks with him in Star-Lord. Like, the yeah, kid. I wish cool. that was a little bit more. Yeah, that was cool. cool. That was definitely that cool. Was cool. But Yondu is a baller in this fucking one. Fucking Yondu. Holy shit, he fucking wrecks house. Yeah, that little... His body count is more than, like, <laughs> r- the record. Than Brock and Rocket anywhere. He's got the biggest body count of that series. Yeah, Holy fuck, oh just God. the entire shit. I mean, it's a cool, it's cool fucking It's cool. It's it needs nerve. I'll give him that. Yeah. It's, I'll give him, like I just said when we left the theater. I'll give him that. It's a unique weapon. Yeah. A needle that kills people by whistling. Yeah. Yes. I haven't really heard that True. before. Good on you, Marvel, for something <laughs> new. Like, new. 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 Um, I'd also like to point out, sorry, Yondu fans, uh, he fucking eats a cock in this. He just yeah. dies. Yeah. yeah. Um, which is unfortunate movie. because he's a founding member of the fucking Guardians. Yeah, that's kind of pisses off. Some I like how everyone Guardians almost fans. dies in space like all the time. Like in the first movie, yeah. uh, like Star Lord yeah. almost dies, yeah. and this one they yeah. have like Yondu dies in space. Bullshit. Can they just not go in space without like uniforms or yeah. something? It's bullshit sure. because like yeah. because they save they could only save the main character when yeah. he's out in space. Anyone else who's out in space can't be saved, yeah. but Star Lord can. Yeah, yeah. But um, I mean that was pretty cool. All right, let's get into the villain. Yes, the Papa. I okay. fucking loved him. Yeah, he, yeah. Was, he was. It was cool. One I, of the best Marvel villains. I go as far as to say he's probably one of the like. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he is the best like so far. Mm. I'd well, say. We have Loki still. Loki. Uh, yeah. Loki was good. Uh, True. I don't know as a villain. He's though. very he good cool as a character. Like villain, he just came to Earth. And yeah. Fucking. My army. I enjoyed this one a little more yeah, because. Definitely. <laughs> if it, it wasn't so much like with Loki, how it's like I don't even want the throne or whatever. Yeah. I want to own a player. His was like I am a universe, so I have to see things from another perspective. Yeah, yeah the whole like God complex. Yeah, like, definitely. Yeah. And that's always a really cool kind yeah. of dynamic. Yeah. And the whole like thing where they switch the tables when they thought he was good and he's a villain. Yeah, that was, that was so, like he just fucking yeah, just geez. fucking it's just, asshole. Yeah, he yeah. literally yeah. has his the dead. Skull, the skulls of his children yeah. underneath the planet, and there's a lot yeah. of skulls. Yeah, there's yeah. a lot of skulls. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so yeah, a lot of skulls. it's. it's fucking um, and I'm just gonna point this out as a, as a side note from Goblin. Um, 
Uh, Thanos looks like a little bitch compared yeah. to this guy. Definitely, yeah, I agree. As of now. Yeah. This he's, guy came close... He's like nothing. This guy has come closer to destroying the galaxy more so than like, <coughs> Thanos at this point. Yeah. Legit, if Thanos like destroys half the galaxy, it's still like that... Yeah, it's like, yeah. it's like... Well, it's like it's already kind of... Like, it's it's kind of died, fucked yeah. up. Yeah. Seriously. All uh, right. Uh, um, okay, so gold people. Gold, gold people. people. Uh, I didn't like them. I liked their ships. I didn't like them. Yeah. They were bland, boring, and they yeah. just felt like the generic aliens from the first one when they just colored them in yeah, different exactly. color. I really wish yeah. that, like, I really wish that when they said, like, all oh, these, I, like, these people, they kill you if you're impolite. I really wish they showed that off, like, hard. Yeah, but they, no, it's bullshit. Like, yeah. <laughs> Like My problem with like the alien designs in general is I feel like they either go a zombie kind of effect or they just color them a different color. True. There was a few aliens that looked okay, but they were in the background. Yeah. yeah. But, like, my issue with Guardians is still a lot of the aliens are very, like, their designs yeah. are very uninspired. Yeah. Sure, yeah. Just like, like look at the main them. Guardians of the Galaxy. Besides Rocket, Raccoon, and Groot, they're yeah, just kind of different sure. color humans. Yeah. Pretty much, yeah. Yeah. Like, even, like, Nebula or whatever <laughs> is just... Blue yeah. robot, pretty woman much thing. woman. Thing. Yeah, and Yondu is a blue dude with a mohawk. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> and then everyone else in the pirate quarters are all like half, like a good chunk of just yeah. guys. Yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah, definitely. Also, like, where the fuck was the Nova Corps during this? Yeah, just they're just they're just gone. Oh, yeah. they, they they retired after the first movie. You know, they're like, the ah, galactic whatever. police or whatever. Yeah. Not even in this movie. Not so gonna, make it Someone's destroying Gal. No, it doesn't matter. Yeah. I like I like how their city... Did, I like how Nova City just got leveled. Yeah. yeah true, yeah. <laughs> but the Nova Corps doesn't do anything about it. They don't yeah. try and... Like, I'd like to point there. out that on all these advanced alien civilizations, they never noticed the little fucking flower that was, mm, like, not... True. Like, just chilling. Yeah, in the middle yeah. of the city, <laughs> just, like, here's a little flower and yeah. stuff. Uh, different, it's not a part of our nature, our ecosystem, better just leave it alone, I guess. Yeah. Do you think one dude with a pair of VR, uh, like, a pair? Yeah, he's just, just like, uh. What if, uh, some of the planets that didn't get, ex like, didn't get fucked up by it, <laughs> a guy in a lawnmower just ran over it True, yeah. by accident? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I don't know, the, the gold people just, they had the whole thing where they were like, oh, we, like, just impregnate ourselves and make, like, <laughs> super beings and children. I like, I mean, it's an interesting setup to Adam Warlock. Because yeah. Adam yeah. Warlock is supposed to be like like that. He's supposed yeah, to be perfect. perfect. Yeah. So. Um. So I mean, I guess they were there to set up Adam Warlock, but it's like, why but have? That's all like, they. Yeah. Did. That's all. Yeah. Like that's kind of lame. That's, that's pretty I know. Cool. It's fucking lame. Um, oh, yeah. and Howard the Duck. Yeah, oh, yeah, he was there. He was there. I'm like, fuck it, fine. Whatever. Whatever. He's not. He's gonna get a movie. Uh, He's gonna get a I movie. Don't want that, Fuck man. You know, I think Howard the Duck should be a member of the Go Earth. die. Shut in a hole. He can be their detective. No, the next one will be like Venom. Uh, Venom will be The only fun. way I could see that movie is it's really crude. You and he just, just <laughs> fucking. He's yeah. pretty much Detective Chimp, but a fucking yeah. duck. Okay. Yeah. Anything else to add, boys? Um, uh, oh, oh, hell yeah. The fucking humor. Oh, yeah. Oh, so the there humor were some moments bullshit. where the humor I'm was sorry. a little too much. It was forced. Like, for example, the fucking Rocket Raccoon calling, like, what, like, a uh, laser face? A taser, taser face. Taser face. Yeah. I was just, like, into the ground. Yeah. Like, just, they use it far too yeah. much. Oh, and the, like, the, the thing that wasn't right. Oh, yeah. 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 That, that and gross. then she bites it, yeah. and, she's the, and then you find out that yeah. it's, it wasn't yeah. right. Yeah. It's funny at the beginning. It's like, ah, oh, nice, but no. that's just... This is just like the, with the Rock and Raccoon thing. You, like, see them all out in space dying and shit, and then it laser face and stuff so, so like that. For yeah, completely contrast, yeah. Like, dark, fucking. And then there was like some dramatic. I can't remember which dramatic scene it was, but there was like a dramatic scene, and then they just throw in a joke, like when they were talking. Oh, yeah. about, uh, I can't remember who they were talking about. Uh, there was a really I think dramatic someone's scene. Past or something. I think like Gamora and her sister. Yeah. She she was having a whole thing. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. And then like she's talking about her past, how how horrible it is, and then one person's like, "Ha!" Oh yeah, yeah I joke. In there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's like, thanks I mean, for ruining an emotionally deep uh, scene with a joke. Sure. Awesome. Thanks, yeah. guys. I mean, yeah. there's some places where you can have jokes, and there's some where it's just... You gotta know awkward. when to put them. It's gotta be appropriate. And sure. some of the... Like, they're pretty good. Like, James Gunn's pretty good with placing jokes and stuff. But, this one, but sometimes... This one was a little bit too much. Yeah, this was a little too much. But some of the ones that landed, landed. They yeah, they fine. definitely did. Yeah, cool. They're that. funny. And it's not like Spider-Man Homecoming. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that one, yeah. yeah, yeah. But besides yeah. that, I mean, that was a good time. Yeah, it was good. I like how we're we're watching this movie about uh, like a galaxy destroying being that's an omniscient life form, and then we're gonna go to Spider Man where it's a guy with wings. Yes, <laughs> web wings, <laughs> web wings, web wings, web wings. 
I blame you. So, yeah. Alright, um, any, any, anything else to add before? I don't really got much. I mean, this villain was way better than this fucking yeah. yeah, definitely. Um, one of the best villains. It's funny because it's like the silliest Marvel villain ever. <laughs> yeah. Like, it's one of the silliest ones. Yeah. He's called the Living Planet, and it's a planet with a brain inside of it. <laughs> this is the most comic yeah. booky thing yeah. I've heard in a while, yeah, and I actually right. managed to make it look fine. It does. So. It works. Fair enough. It's sad when it's better than Ultron. Yeah, yeah fuck the Ultron. It is. <laughs> All right. Also, uh, just real quick, uh, I see what you did with Dairy Queen. Yeah. Yeah. Stop it. <laughs> you really? <laughs> You're like, fuck you, Dairy Queen. They literally went to Dairy Queen to go plant the thing, sure. and then when it explodes, <laughs> you see Dairy Queen again. <laughs> yep. The worst. They needed to be Dairy. They can't go out to a forest or something. No, no, no. They need to go to the forest behind the Dairy Queen, so we can get the exterior shot of the Dairy Queen. <laughs> Dairy queen, dude. Yes, the Dairy Queen. That, that's, that's the main. They like they plant the plant and then you see them come out of the Dairy Queen with a cake and it's like yeah. Yeah. get a blizzard. Come on. Oh, okay. <laughs> get the get the Guardians of the Galaxy. Promoting blizzard. blizzard. Is, is, is no that way. why? Oh my god. Is that why Guardians of the Galaxy had a fucking blizzard? A oh, fucking Dairy Queen. Shit, there's a deeper point. Yep, to there it. there's why they had the blizzard at Dairy oh, Queen. It's because it's in the movie. Oh it's shit. shit. It's against parents. Oh, so Stan Lee's guest appearance. That was fun. Yeah, yeah, oh, by yeah, the way, I like yeah, that. I like how they took yeah. call, made, basically soft the word. He's that, a watcher. Yeah, he's a watcher, and that's cool. It make, actually makes a point to why he's in yeah, every single Marvel, Marvel movie. movie. Even the Hulk one, which isn't connected, but is connected, but yeah, it isn't. It's not. It is. So that's cool. Cheeky fucks him. Damn. Jeez, young. And I like how the watchers, like the watchers, supposed to basically be like. Big heads, circular heads, and diapers and stuff. Yep. And they made them look like the comic, so. Yeah, yeah. On that so good job. Also, I like this. I like the weird. Uh, I like the weird uh, touching the guy's forehead. Marvel things doing now because yeah, like yeah. It, it's strange. Oh yeah. Yeah. And this one. True. Yeah, yeah. I mean Gotham. That's a spoiler. Sorry. Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. I don't know. Oh, bitch. There it is. <laughs> All right. So ratings. Ratings. Let's I'd get into ratings. Oh, uh, Trez, you're. Uh, I'd say a solid eight. All right. Eight out of ten. Goblin, so you're going next. One. Uh, 8.5. All right. And I... I think I'm going to go, like... I think I'm going to go 8.4. 8.4, 8.3, definitely. It's definitely above 8. It's an awesome movie. Fun yeah, time. Uh, got some jokes that don't land, but you, since you're a Marvel yeah. fan, probably watching this, you'll like every... You'll be like... Ah, the... <laughs> I <laughs> found a banalian while it was cut open. <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> Try to do, like, the... Uh, oh, God, song. that's terrible. Anyways, yeah, that was great. I don't get how people thought it was 50 50, though, with the story. Or, like, the different multiple stories going on. I thought it was fine. Yeah. I heard, I just heard that it was a rumor. Yeah. yeah. Anyways, there you go. Yeah, it was good. It was it was very well done. Anyways. He just revealed your deepest, darkest secret. Oh, it's funny because. Oh, my God. Alright. Alright, okay. so, I'm Anarchy, <laughs> you the Chaos. I'm Just Gaming. And I'm Goblin Angry. And this has been another movie review. Yeah.